One of the basic necessities of life is food. The COVID-19 lockdown has restricted residents from sourcing for their daily bread as a result of the federal government directive that residents must stay at home. An initiative aimed at curbing the spread of COVID-19 pandemic across the globe. To ameliorate the effect of the lockdown on residents, the authorities of Itiria Kati Local Council Development Area, led by Ahmed Akbatira, called for a press parley to intimate the public on some of the measures taken in containing the spread of COVID-19, at the same time procuring relief items for distribution across the council's political world. The flag of exercise was witnessed by key stakeholders, council executives and CDC executives. Items to be distributed across the council's political world include two bars of yam, rice, beans, guari and noodle sparks. The council emsman disclosed that the relief items are targeted at the vulnerable, the less privileged and the physically challenged, noting that about 15,000 households would benefit from the gesture. The targeted audience, 15,000 households in Itireka the local council development area in the phase two. The tenant association, the landlord, the councillors, the supervisors, the youth, the woman leader, the world chairman, the royal father, the disabled are not left behind in the distribution, together with the children. We have provision for the children also. We will witness many good deeds from this administration. We continue to strive to stop the pandemic. I thank you all for abiding to the restriction and playing to the rules of social distancing. Please keep safe, wash your hand, use hand sanitizer, don't put hand into your eye, your ear, nose and mouth. Stakeholders applauded the council authorities over the initiative. I want to say a thank you to our chairman, Dr. Um, Honorable Dr. Ahmed Olarewaju Akwatira. He has done so very much for us. Um, since March, um, since the lockdown of um, the COVID-19, um, he has he's been doing a lot of things for everyone in the local government, in the community, especially for the vulnerable people. And um, a lot of people have been, you know, have been so appreciative. And outside that, um, after then, the governor sent in some, some kind of um, food in for us as well. And um, he did so well by making sure everything gets to the people that needs it. Okay. Uh, what I would say is that Let's of us thank Almighty Allah for everything. I think we are not rookie in this. This is our second batch. We have done the first batch. And if you go around in our community, you will hear what people are saying. But this time around, we are trying to make sure that 15,000 households benefit from what we are planning to do. And if you if you're able to go around and you will see all our relief package by tomorrow, we'll distribute everything, including water. The initiative will impact a great number of households during this period.